Hi, Rich here, and we're in Venice, a city with beautiful architecture. And of course, we want to take pictures of that. But when we do it, we have to take our lens and tilt it up a little bit to get the whole building in the photograph. And anytime your lens isn't perfectly parallel with the ground, you introduce distortion. If you turn your lens down to the ground, things will look like they're falling over towards you. And if you turn your lens up to get more of the building in the picture, the building looks like it's falling over backwards. And here's a perfect example. A beautiful basilica, but we've got a little uh, cropping work that needs to be done, and we have that vertical distortion. So I'm going to use the crop tool, as we usually do, and just get rid of some of that extraneous uh, uh, stuff I have on the side. And I could leave it at that. Whoops, missed a spot. There we go. And I could leave it at that, but I'd really like to correct some of that vertical distortion. And if I go back to the crop tool, and a little further down in the menu, you'll see that I have the option to do something called lens corrections. And I can correct both vertical and horizontal distortion, as well as rotate it and, and do some other things. But we're concerned here with vertical distortion. So I'm going to make some adjustments. Now, if I go too far, as I have here, I recreate a different kind of distortion, and that's no fun. So like most things in Lightroom, you want to be a little gentle with your tools. And in this case, I think minus 20 is just about right. There's my after in the shot. Now, you might not think that made much of a difference, but just take a look at a side-by-side -side comparison. There's the before and there's the after. And as you can see, we've improved the uh, perspective on this building a great deal. It's important that you don't overcorrect on this because overcorrect work looks worse than no correction at all. Our eyes are used to a little bit of distortion. I mean, it's the way we view the world. We're always tilting our heads up or down. So a little bit's fine. And when I do make corrections like this, I'm gentler with the tool than I would be otherwise. Well, this is Rich. My gondola is waiting. Off I go.